Hey, and welcome back to Let's Play Dungeon Master 2, Legend of Skullkeep. Picking up where we left off, we need to start leveling our magic users as fighters so that they can carry things at all and not flake under uh, any sort of pressure. That is the advice that I have received on the interwebs. Oh, another gear. Give that to Bane, who can still carry things. Then I have time. I wonder what you do. You've got magic of some description. Naturally, we're going to look it up. Let's see what the Eye of Time does. Items. Items. There we go. Straight away, top of the list. Freezes, creatures, cast aura of speed. Very nice. Uh, it's a shame there's no ring slot dedicated. Put that there, we can. Okay, I assume we equip it like a weapon and use it like a weapon when we're ready. So I assume we put our gear there. And we've got two of them. The large gear and a large gear. I assume we just put both in there. Okay, so they'll open both of those. We can have a drink there, apparently. How's our wa how are our water skins? Okay, we'll carry that. Okay. Bane can carry that then. There we go, that's better. Um, let's see. Map. So we've got a... Oh, that's right, our marker is over there, isn't it? I need to remember how we go getting rid of that. Also... Are there any secrets? No, I can never remember which... Okay, well there's a, a ladder, we're not going to use that yet. That's a door. What's the thing that opens the door? Not that I can see. Well, this is ominous. Why do we have all of this here? Hmm. Well, that there. Let's see while we're here. Let's just get some light going. Okay, we'll open you. Bane! Lordy, another one. Well, I'm assuming that's... Hey! That's under here, then. Oh, what have we... Oh, we're... Of course we're crippled. And apparently, that affects their ability to walk. Whose feet are broken? No one's feet. Whatever. I got nothing. Okay, well, we're going to do the brave thing here. We're going to swap our front row with our back row, like so. And I'm sure we're going to regret this. What the... F oh. Nope. Okay, we're going to swap our front row with our back row again. We're going to give our weapons back. And next time we're in town, we will level, we'll grind some fighter levels for the experience. Uh, for the moment, what we want is the biggest weakened non-material being spell we can muster. Come on. Really should have had two of those ready. There we go. Oh, hey. You got some health. No, we need to rest. Well, we'll gain our hit points back. Oh, we need to gain our mana back too. Okay, well. Let's see, our mages could stand to have a drink. Okay, and we'll rest. Okay, now. We got both of them ready this time. Come on. At least they phase in and out to give you a moment to get the spells ready. I do appreciate that. Okay. Okay. 
Hmm. Anything showing up on our map? The torch. Really couldn't care less about the torch. We have a niche. Put the torch in the niche. We've got a grating and some bones. Well, I am at a total loss as to what the bloody point of this is. And the map is wearing off because um, his magic was wearing out. I'm asleep. Okay. Just out of sheer curiosity, will swinging an axe gain her points? Is she just going to level up as a fighter by doing this? Doesn't look like it. Oh, she will! Okay, well then. That's what we're going to do then. What the actual... Oh, for Christ's sake. Okay, now, where were we? Grab Bane's other axe. Another fighter level. Wonder if it was this simple in the original game too. Give it one more. Okay, now, it's, now it's taking a bit of a toll. Okay, well, that being said, she gained a level, gained a couple of levels there. Let her sleep and see how that affects her encumbrance from there. And just one moment. Okay, sorry about that. Alright, so, Het, we're going to give your weapons back to Bane. You've gained a couple of levels. 40 kilograms, I'm sure that's a... Now we're going to give her another one. I want to see how this how this goes. So she's on 40 flat at the moment. What is it? What does a level give? So we'll rest. I'm not expecting a massive increase. 42 kilos. Oh, but yeah, she's worked up quite an appetite in the process. We'll sleep. Okay, I'm very okay with that. Get a one more level. I know I keep saying one more, one more, one more, but it's a bloody good investment. And also, we can science and see just how much people will, will, inc will improve. I like the way that her metabolism is working though, that she's actually eating or going through more food and working up an appetite um, through all the exercise. I can really respect that. Come on, can we have one more please? Any day now. Oh, she's tired again. I'd like to get her up to carrying 45 kilos if I can, but I'll be happy if I'll be happy with any improvement, honestly. There we go. 42 kilos. Nope, still still stuck on 42 kilos. I'm not unhappy with that though. She has done bloody well. She can have a rest. Seri, your turn. Head will just give those to you. 
Okay, Sari. So what is Het now? She is a journeyman fighter. What is Sari? She is a nothing fighter, so this first level should come fairly quickly then. I said it should come fairly quickly then. There we go. Oi. I think that got him. I'll take it. Probably not the smartest place to be doing this, I realize. Man, if I'd known it was this simple so much earlier, we would have been such a higher level before coming down here. What is she now? An apprentice fighter. She's getting there. How is she for... Oh, she's not hungry yet. What's hurting? Oh, it's just her stats need time to recover. So we shall let her recover. She now carry 36 kilograms. I don't necessarily see her catching up to Het, but hey, I'll take what we can get. And it's not just carrying capacity, it's the ability to not wear themselves out so easily. Get this bit done, and then we'll get back to exploring. I'm assuming cleave is a, a bigger expenditure, but also a commensurate uh, experience boost. At least that's what I'm hoping. I'm sure someone will know more and, and fill me in in the comments. That's another level. What is she now? Journeyman! Okay, so she's caught up. She has a carrying capacity of 35. 39. Okay, that is an improvement. We will go with that. Okay, so give those back to Bane, please. And fighters. Uh, light, please. Also, we can non-material beings at the ready. If anyone's got any mana. There we go. Okay. So you don't do anything there. What about you there? Right, this grating is a thing. What if we use our map, put our marker down, and then tell our thing to really lift the grate? No. Okay, well that was worth a shot. What the hell is that? I want to know what that is. I also really don't want to know what that is. Hmm. I really wish I could clear this marker so badly. So we have another grating there. Is it the same? No, it's a square one over here, isn't it? Yeah. Give that to Sari for the moment. Um, what was that? Ah, okay. Another Vorpal Blade, meh. Didn't see that coming. Come on. I know you're still there. Go, Torum. Another one ready. Okay. So they spawn well enough to grind some decent mage levels. 
Alas, what we haven't found down here is what we really wanted. Oh god, who's encumbered now? Oh, she's hungry. I hear that. Bloody drones. Okay, what was that on the wall? I'm sure I saw something. Or not. God, who's encumbered now? Oh, Sari's feet are broken, apparently. That's it, drink the red potion. That's exactly what you need to do. Um. Okay, well, who doesn't yet have a spell at the ready? Bane? Torum. Okay, Torum, you can do this. Ah, oh, the priest level. Everyone's leveling. I'm okay with this. Though I'm disappointed that we don't have... We don't have that third wheel yet. Hmm. Have a drink. We don't have to buy that gear, do we? Actually, let's just do that. Let's just buy that gear. Where was the inn? I love that we can even have that as an option. Do that. Yeah, you were, weren't you? You were in the, the one with all the axes. Oh my god, and everyone's gonna whinge that I'm picking up axes again. We will do our best to ignore the axes. Let's see. I'm not using my teleporter. I've learnt my lesson. Oh, hey. Hello, food source. Hello, food. I'm going to grab you because we're going through a fair bit with the levels that we will be... Grinding, and I will grind a few levels. I might just, I might just off screen it afterwards. Because I know no one wants to sit here and watch me fucking grind through fighter levels for the sake of hit points and stuff. I get that. Oh, fuck you, buddy. There we go. Bane's not hitting like he used to. Oh, that's a bit better. Okay. Everyone can eat while we're here. Decent attack they have. I will right, leave that food now. We don't need all of it. I just need to get to the other village. Uh, I'm wishing I'd kept that, uh, that magic map now. The one, ju just the one that acts as only a map that lets us see where the hell we're going. Oh my god. Because this is infuriating. Having to do this every few tiles because of the friggin' game. Oh, hey, Tornado. Yeah, you. Screw you. Right, Mana Blossom, we might as well just grab. Okay, so the tornadoes will just keep coming back, apparently. Duly noted. And there's nothing else here that we apparently need to concern ourselves with, other than getting revenge on that tornado, which I was very happy to do. You know what? I know, know now that I've actually gone completely the wrong way. Because we had to unlock this bit with a key. 
Okay, we got the thieves through here. We've got the thing that we're going to cut down here because it's in our way and we're too lazy to walk around it. Oh, you are so fucked, buddy. Okay, some gold. And a dagger that we're never going to do anything with. And I'm just going to quickly... Let's see, um... Oh, where is it? There we go. So I just had, had to quickly interview with my phone because it's got 9 o'clock here and my phone has a do not disturb mode that kicks in at 9, 9 o'clock at night. I think we're on the right track. Where was it? Okay, so there's, there's the axe that we're ignoring for the moment. Die. Oh my god, the axes, the axes. They will be here when we're ready for more gold though. There really is no impetus right now to be farming. Unless the cost of these objects that we need is something exorbitant. I want the tavern, I believe. This is not a tavern. That is not a tavern. Oh my god, really? We'll see what they've all got. Oddly enough, no gear. Literally. Um, the clothier perhaps? What do you have? I know someone was selling it. Um... Hmm... I wouldn't feel like a right idiot if it was back at the start. Oh, another Vorax. There we go, there we go, I saw it, I saw it! We're going to buy both of these because it could just save us a lot of stress. So a gold and a silver. There you go. I like the way it actually stops you from... Um, from ripping him off part way through there. We can buy multiples. I'm going to remember this. You know what? They're cheap enough. Let's buy a second one. Purely, 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 purely because I'd like to have the option just in case there is another one that we need. Okay, so I've grabbed those and that vacuum tube. One, two, three, and four. Okay, we'll give that to Torum. How heavy are you? Half a kilo. And three and a half kilos. Okay, we've got a torch, we've got a tapestry, none of which I care about. This I care about! We've got a magic map, or we've got a magic map? You're blue. You're just a map. That is what I want. We'll keep the minion map, but I think we just want the magic one. For the sake of just getting from A to B, I just want the magic map. No, no, no. We don't want to go that way. Okay, back we go. Some more light. Yeah, it sucks to be you. Okay. 
And back this away. Actually, no, through here was the cemetery. Um, actually, can we? No, we actually have to engage them to get through. Got all this for a possible shortcut. Come on. Thank you. Oh, now he hits for 200. Three here. Three here. And this way. So we're getting there. We roughly know what we're doing. We have a fair approximation of what should be done and how to do it. Okay. There's the wall that we can walk through. So. I hate you, game. Okay. Oh my lord. Alright. We got this. There was another one. Really? Really? Oh my god, we have to re go back and res her. Fucking hell. Oh, I am indescribably pissed about that. <sighs> that is some table flipping bullshit right there. Yeah, fuck you, ghost. Right. Jesus fucking Christ. Alright, we're gonna haul literally all of this back to town. Fucking piss off, Vorpal Blade. No one likes you. Oh, fuck you! Oh my god. Come on. Now, can we please get back to what we were doing? Potions we'll just come back for. Some of that guard minion, what the hell are we going to do with it? That. 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 We'll carry what we can. Apparently that's it. Back up we go. What are you? Oh, that's that Vorpal Blade we don't care about. I'm so worked about that. We have to haul us all the way back, to, not just to town, but to that start dungeon. Thank god we at least have teleport. Okay, so where was it? Through here? Yes. Ah, oh, so much salt. So much salt. Okay, that was hers, that was hers, that was hers. Oh my god, she's also carrying another map. We can drop the scout map, don't care about that. Was she wearing a helmet? Possibly not. They can just fuck right off. Can we light that? That's why we needed a torch, didn't we? Because that's just something we can do.
Okay, at least it's not a huge track, but I'm still allowed to be salty as a get out about that. Just grumble. Okay. I'm gonna rest here, let Sarah get some magic back. Alright, who's hungry? Is anyone hungry? No. We're tired and sick of the game shit, but we're not hungry. One. Two. Three. Four. Grab these potions. Ready for the more, more of the game's bullshit at any turn. I'm going to keep hold of that for the moment, just in case it is something that we need for anything. That's closed. Aha, we do need another one. Oh, really? I got nothing. Oh my god, what is with them? Come here and let me smack you. What is spawning these assholes? There, die. Fuck off. So there's no pit there. I move forward! <clears throat> okay. There was no lag. The keystroke was. Nah. Whatever. Whatever. Let's just do this. This is a part of the game that I'm just outright not enjoying one bit. Where's the la How many more of these fucking gears are we going to need? Oh, you guys can just eat shit and die. Are oh, we gonna save? I do actually need to pause it there as well, so just one moment. Okay, when we're back. Uh, we've got a square key. We've got a lever. We've got a keystroke that... Okay, so we came from there. I just got myself turned around then. We have portals of some description. We've got a motherfucker who casts a hell of a freaking spell there. Got another large gear which we'll just throw into Het's inventory apparently. Another teleport point. Oh god, who's tired over encumbered what now? Oh, you've got an owie. There. Shut up. Okay, well. Let's start doing things. Furnace on level below must be stoked and burning. Before using boiler, turn on water valves two levels up. Some kind of engine room then. And I assume you go there. Okay. Well, that was the thing. Not quite sure what that did, but it's a thing. Alright then. Let's quickly check that. Sorry, other half just letting me know that she's on her way home from work, which I do appreciate because she works uh, in a place that I appreciate knowing that she is safe at the end of the day. Well, we've got another teleport point there. 
What do you guys do? That's security footage by the look of it of the furnace. Let's have a look downstairs then. Okay, we can't go down there. There we go. Oh, I see the switch lowers the lever, the ladder. That's cool. Just like that, we've got a reason to enjoy the game again. Nifty things like that. Pyro. Reminds me of the rocks that we'd find in either beholder. Right, so we murdered you. Right, so I reckon Pyro goes in there then. No? What the fuck does Pyro do then? It's a long shot, but um... Nope. Tried nothing and I'm all out of ideas. So she's looking a bit tired. How much does Pyro weigh? Eight kilograms. Wow. Got a hole there with some more Pyro on the other side. Oh, just a moment. Okay, and I'm back. Sorry about that. There are a lot of interruptions this episode, and I do apologize for that, but that's life sometimes. More Pyro here. I can only assume that this is something that we need. I expect that we are extremely overloaded and I am moving accordingly very, very slowly. Let's see. Plenty of light. Is it possible to get to Master Wizard by only casting the light spell, I wonder? Probably is. See, I get the impression that you're meant to do a thing, but I don't know what that thing is. The doorway here. Oh, bats. Whatever. Rock, a giant a boulder, I should say. Pit down. I'm well aware that we are painfully over encumbered, but right now there is so much pyro on the ground that I want to be picking it up so that when we find wherever it's meant to go, we've got it there. Into more potions of red here. I believe that were fighter potions. And the bats really don't bother me. Not anymore. there. Okay. Whoops. Never mind. Down we go after it. Crunch. That's what we get. Right, who's broken what from that? No one. Pleasantly surprised there. Uh, can we just fill that up, please? What the fuck was that? Okay. I have no idea what that did. Okay, that's better. Um. Ah, uh, hey. Uh, uh, uh. 
Bit of experience. Just get Torum some hit points back. We gained some levels there, that was good. Just heal up our front line. Heal up all of our lines actually by the look of that. Bane, you are looking fine. You're just slow to recover stamina because you got so much of it, I suppose. All things being relative. Oh, you look like something I totally don't want to be fucking with. that we shall apparently three hundred and one oh we got a, a gem seam as well nice Grab that. Of course. Get rid of you. Anything else in there? Nope. There's another gem seam over there, apparently. A ladder down. Wow. This is a big bloody dungeon. Another gem seam. Not going to complain. A Kellen gauntlet. Now that was a thing. I don't remember what that was other than for the purpose of glove slap. So we'll pop you there for inventory space. Hoping that pyro is something we need or I'm going to be... I'm going to be disappointed. I'm not really going to be angry. I'm making the choice to cart it around. Purely off, on, purely off the whim that we might possibly need it. Moving very slowly was as the stairs down. Apparently, we don't take damage from that. I would have thought we took some sort of damage off of that. Do we put Pyro in there? No. Ah. Okay, so we want fire shield. What game, pray tell, was the combination for fire shield then? Uh, get my handy dandy notebook. Fire shield was... That. And that. No, that's fire potion. That's fire shield. So we've got a red thing there which often in indicates a, a trap above or below. Not disappointed. But now we do need to get some health back to literally everyone yes that's it look at it um, sleep get some hit points back and another fire shield please Well, the cave-ins are, are certainly a thing. Um, hmm. Is there any way around? Oh my god!
Literally die, please. Fuck. Oh, a blue gem. Up we go, did we make it? Did we make it? Yes! Okay, that did have me going for just a moment there. I think that would have been a jib for Het. And I really didn't want that. Actually, Het, can we grind a, a ninja level for you? Will that work? It's a fair amount of grinding, but hit points are worth it. Yes! Get one more. Here, skeleton. And where were we? <sighs> there we go. So what is she now? She's a, a journeyman ninja, an expert priest, and I think that means a, a lesser master wizard. The chevron's pointing that way. Sleep, get, get everyone's health back. You know what, we're just gonna potion. Say what? Oh, moron. Nope. Sorry, a potion to get her health back. Oh my god. Two down. While we're here, we might as well partake of these worm rounds. I realize that food truly isn't a problem, but why not while we're here? Nom on those, and then Bane, you can have a steak. Of course you're hurt. And... Well, what are you poisoned? You're poisoned. Of course you're poisoned. Do we have a kill poison? We have a kill poison. Happiness! Happiness is a potion of kill poison apparently, so... Kill poison was that and that. Yes. And light. And map. So the gems are, are a thing down here. Certainly appreciating that. Wanna head back to that ladder, I suppose. No, we don't. We want to go back upstairs, rest, get our fighter's stamina back. Which is going to be quite a rest, just looking at that. Get their stamina back, and then we can fire shield, and then we can go back down. Because I am going to just treat those guys like I did the critters in... Um... Oh my god, there we go. Uh, the, the, the fire elementals in Legend of Grimrock 2. We're just going to let them kamikaze themselves. It honestly seems to me to be the most efficient way of dealing with them. They also seem to be going off on their own way. 
Yeah, as long as we keep fire shield up, they're not a huge threat. Famous last words. It's going to save our game, I think. Torum's got a bit of a headache, apparently. Alright, so we need to find a hole up on the next level by the looks. Yay, a gold coin. So the fact that the game is giving us money at this point does have me asking questions like, why do we need the money? So yes, we need to find one. We need to find the holes that will let us access those. Where does that go? That goes nowhere that we care about. Okay. Um, well, we're going to leave these pyro here, I think. We'll leave them by this door. That's a convenient landmark. We'll just drop them down here. The reason being is that we're going to wear ourselves out a lot quicker carrying them around. And they're going to affect everyone's combat capability. That's the last thing that we want. So, Ket. We need to start dosing everyone back up on healing potions. And sleep. I see you. And straight away our mobility is greatly improved. Nice top level fireball from our fighter. Nothing there yet. I'm going to check them every time I go past because, hey, gold. Oh, I hear you. He failed but still gained the level apparently. Works for me. Make it die. Okay, we're hurting again. Seems to be the theme. Hmm. Were there any more holes? That's what he said. There's another ladder there. Let's go and investigate that. That's not a ladder, that's a hole down from above. Hello thing that we're going to run this way from now. Okay, so they cast poison cloud and a general assholes. Duly noted. Fortunately creatures don't seem to cross those doorways. Because reasons, I'm sure. There are holes from above. Nothing going down though. We have another fireball, please. Someone. You're an asshole. Come on. You got some health on you. Right, falling back. Okay, we're going to heal up. Apparently everyone's poisoned as well. No, just our front line. Okay. So, first things first. Cure poison, please. Oh my god. Oh, can we rest at least? Yes. 
That's something. He is not so poisoned that resting is going to be a, a negative experience. Just a so tedious one. See, everyone can just drink up, really. Okay, so she's used up all of her mana. Oh my god. Do you bloody mind? There we go. Now. Who else needed it? No one else really needs it right now, so we're just going to hold on to it. I will, however, make up another Cure Poison while we're here. With Seri, because Seri has mana, unlike her useless partner. Grumble. Oh, what am I doing? There we go. Fuck wit. I'm not a bright man. I am not a bright man at all. It also look like perhaps Het's um, getting a bit hungry. Not good. Yeah, relative to the rest of the party, she sure as hell is. There you go. Water's not quite a concern yet. Um, but we're at an hour, so I'm going to save. And next episode we're going to continue on with these trolls. Or whatever the hell they are. But for now, I hope you've enjoyed yourselves. By all means, keep the hints coming in the comments. Um, and I will catch you all next episode. But until then, cheers.